Hey guys, just doing a uh, review of my newest model. It's a Mack front discharge concrete truck made by First Gear. It is 134 scale and uh, this one here is the First Gear uh, brand. I want to say it's a really nice truck. It's got the heavy duty drop down axle. You've got your concrete drum right there and that is the spindle there where it would turn and uh, where is it right there you got your rollers for the drum I'm trying to remember I believe it turns on a motor right back here and you got some uh, air tanks for the suspension and everything like that you got your water tank which I believe is a 200 gallon uh, it's a really nice truck you got your mirrors the front of the truck uh, you could take the chutes off and it folds up and raises up let's see if I can get it to raise up here no, I can't right now but you got the front end of the truck right there as you can see right there it's really nice detail it's got the uh, wash hose there you got your Mac emblem there your lift cylinder and your swivel right there you got your lock pin right there in case you need to get pulled out get hung up this is the front axle all-wheel drive it's got the nice big wide tires on it. Let's see. There we go. That's probably worked a little better. Then you got your steps that go up. Let's see. There we go. Got it to focus. And you got your landing right there, which I think is etched through. I can't really tell. You got another hose right there for cleaning out. Your concrete would be poured from the hopper into there then you mix it up and you got your platform there where you put your chutes oh you know what actually really nice detail right there you got your water level gauge right there which is really nice you got your etch step there then other steps really nice detail let's see if we can get inside there and get focus you got your controls for the operator to run the truck inside oh, sorry for being shaky guys you got your gauges there you got your air tanks right there you got your exhaust stack air cleaner one thing I really like about this model doesn't open up too much but there's your rear motor right there you got your radiator your fan your turbo right there air intake exhaust you got your reserve bottle right there Across the back here you got your radiator, your marker lights, tail lights, reverse lights, and you've got another hitch right back there. Really nice. I, I have to say I really like this model. I might be getting a few more of these. But uh, overall really nice truck. Let's see if I can get a better view here. There we go. The outside controls for the operator. Ah, this thing wants to roll. As you can see right there, you got your signal lights. You got your Mac Bulldog on there. You don't see too many of these out in the country. These are more mainly used in the city areas where it's a lot easier for the truck to pull right in, right to where you need to pour. Where I, when I was growing up, we had a lot of these 
coming in pouring our foundations and garages and whatever we were doing but uh, I haven't seen many around where I'm at now here in Virginia but it's a really nice truck well I think I think that's about it oh you know what here let's do the undercarriage forgot about that let's see got it to work there we got emergency control the hydraulic controls right there then you got your front axle drive line your other axles oh, that's your drop down axle there and they all have wide tires on them and they work really nice let's see if I can get the uh, there it is if you can see back there that's the axle uh, the drive shaft that comes from the transmission to the transfer case which then reverses everything so the wheels turn the right way really nice detail on this model I, re I recommend everybody getting it I'm not too fond of the colors I like lighter colors where you can see more detail but still a great truck all right well thanks for watching please rate comment and subscribe